crypto slow, cryptocurrency news and investing. Crypto slow with more crypto gains. What's going on, guys? I got a good one for you today. A good old TRX honeypot scam. So, if you're uh, on Twitter, you're basically getting random DMs that says, Hi, I'm a student. I have $500, $10,000 in USDT in my Tron wallet. Here's my private key. Please help me. Okay, now, first and foremost, I would never steal anyone's money. Unless it was a scammer. Then I would scam the scammer. Uh, <laughs> but this type of stuff interests me. And I always like to put this out to the public so you know what's going on. Uh, shout out to Luho uh, Senpao. He, he'd gotten this and he'd posted this. And I'd gotten some DMs in my Twitter. And I was like, oh, so how does it work? So anyways, they send you a private message. You get the, you get the uh, private key, okay? So after I saw this, then I actually went and started digging around on it. So over here on my Tron link, I imported this wallet. It says there's 500 smackaroonies in this wallet. Please help the student. Well, so I go over here and then I go over to Tron scan. I pop this in and then I look at the account and sure enough, there there is, let's see here, asset TRX. Yeah, so there's 500 bucks in here and it shows up as US, oh, as Tether, USDT. Okay, looks legit. Okay, looks legit. So you're like, oh, shoot. All I have to do is send this account some Tron and then I can transfer the cash out. Boom, $500. I'm going to the Sizzler tonight. Well, got to got to see what's going on here. So what happens is as soon as you send this account, TRX, a bot or a contract or something that's monitoring this account automatically forwards this to a second address. And you're like, well, what if I'm fast? I'll send the Tron and then I will send it out faster than the scammer and I'll get the USDT. Well, let's look at this account in more detail. So if you go and look at the account um, under Tronscan Wallet account, okay, we click on account. Now we get into the deep dive here. Access settings, owner permission. Okay, so the account that, let's see here. Let me refresh this, get it nice and clean here. Okay, so this is the address of the scammer PK that he gave you, okay? Address setting, looks, looks legit. Owner permission is actually a second account. And what is owner permission? Owner permission controls all of these sub permissions. All right, without geeking out too hard here, what does this mean? That means that even if you did beat this person's bot, um, when you would go to send the USDT, the account, the account one, would not have permission. So account one, you got the PK from the scammer, and you put this in, but the account actually has no active permissions. And guess what, the second account, so here's the second account, and if you look, there's the honeypot. Oh, shoot. Where is this? Yeah, that's it. So the second account has about 7,000 TRX in it, and it's getting fed by the scam account. Okay? So you're like, oh, I got an idea. I'll just loan it energy from my account. So if you know how Tron works, you can actually loan energy to other people. So as a test, this is before I figured out the account permissions, I loaned it energy because energy allows you to do transactions without having Tron in the wallet. But what'll happen is I'll try to go and send this and then the transaction fails. And the reason it fails is because the account one, the one you have imported, does not have permissions to transfer accounts. 
Well, you're like, that's real easy. The hacker's kind of stupid. I'm going to edit the access and I'm going to change the account to um, the account one. Okay. Great idea. Save. It costs 100 TRX. So there lies the problem. You'll try to do this and confirm it, but then you don't have any TRX in this account in order to change the permissions. So that is it. Honeypot, you get contacted on DM. It says, get some cash. I'm a student. I need help. Uh, you send some Tron or you loan it energy. And then you try to send the USDT or whatever USDC out of the wallet and it fails because it is actually wired to a second account and only the second account has permissions to send Tron out of the wallet. So hope you liked today's video. Stay safe out there. As always, this is Crypto Slow. If you're not talking gains, then we're not talking.